Hey everyone, Harriet here, hope you're doing okay. So today we have a brand new box. I don't think many people knew about this unless you listened to the Back to the 80s podcast that I was in, but I have a brand new loot crate and it is, I don't think you can see it, but it is the slam crate for WWE, baby. <laughs> so this is by loot crate. This is, oh God, I don't know how many they've done now, but this is the brand new, box this was released in america first i think and then i think we've got the sign ups later on in the uk this is a bi-monthly box so this is going to come every two months so i am really looking forward to this i know two of the items in this um one is a shirt for enzo and cass i think because you got that if you pre-ordered this and also a new day figure so let's get open you guys know i'm a massive wrestling fan so i cannot wait to see what is inside this oh lovely so the first one we have is an austin aries card or aries card from nxt and i'm gonna close up because i never do close ups of my items which is strange um so it says on the back since his arrival in nxt austin aries has proven himself to be the most determined superstar on the roster implementing an offense that's equal parts hard hitting and high flying aries racks up world championships wherever he went backing up the extra confident superstar monkey the great uh, monkey yeah the greatest man that ever lived so that is a tops card um it says look out for the rest in december i have enough tops cards as it is so that's another collection i'm gonna have to add to so that's really nice next up this is the shirt that i knew i was getting so it is a it is an Enzo and Cash shirt, bada bing, bada boom, realest guys in the room. How are you doing? <laughs> I love that. I don't actually own an Enzo and Cash shirt. I have several Roman, I have New Day, I have a Sasha, and I think that's it. Oh, I have a Dean Ambrose one as well, which is a bit too big for me now. But I love that. Um, real cool guys, Enzo and Cash. Love their promo stuff, so I really, really like that shirt. Yeah. Now, if you cannot tell, I am a New Day fan. And you should know that if you watch my prediction video. New Day Rocks! New Day Rocks! So I love that figure. Um, I'm going to open it and do a close up. It's basically the three members of the New Day riding a unicorn, and the unicorn is wearing sneakers because why not? <laughs> so let's open this up and have a close up. I should show off the book before I show off the figure. So it has the 100% uh, uh, made with 100% made with positivity, as it says on the cereal box there. It has all three members on the back and just has their logo around the sides so let's have a look at this figure so i'm gonna do a close-up so that is all the members i love that figure it's nice and weighty as well it's not you know it's not something that could easily fall off you know like a shelf with the wind or something like that and i love that i'm gonna have a quick look myself can you no you can't turn the head so it's <laughs> so you have um you have xavier kofi and biggie and like I said, he's wearing sneakers because why not? It's the New Day. I really like that. Because <laughs> I have the New Day figures behind the camera there. I have all three. And they've just announced that they're releasing another three packed in a special box. I'm looking forward to getting them because I love New Day. And I love this figure. Oh, next I have something that is very close to my heart because I love Sasha Banks. And I did cosplay her last weekend or the weekend before at expo so i have my brand new glasses i can wear with my cosplay <laughs> and it has on the side a legit boss and then sasha banks there we go have a do a zoom in there i hope you can see with the blue legit boss and then on the inside it has a loot crates logo but i love blue and that's gonna go fantastic with the pink wig uh the pink wig it's really difficult to say that oh i love these they're really cool and uh Shutter glasses are actually, <laughs> I didn't like them at first, but I'm slowly getting used to them, so I really like those. Okay, next we have a pin. Oh, this is awesome. <laughs> Couldn't resist it. It is the World Heavyweight Championship, and this is the original one, I believe. Um, or one of the old school championships, and the first. Oh, that's what the box is. So this is the first i'm hoping this is what they're going to do every month because as you know loot crates do um exclusive items each month so loot crate has the pin anime has the charm 
Um, I'm not sure what Gaiman has or, or any of the others, so I'm hoping this is what's going to be in the rest of the boxes, but we'll find out. So we're in November now, by monthly, so we'll find out in January if we get any more of these badges, but that is beautiful, and I'm going to have to find somewhere to put that, because that is just so beautiful. It's amazing. Thank you, Luke. Oh, what is this? It's a belt buckle. Um, I don't know what kind of belt buckle, but... Let's have a look these and see. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> it's a Loot Crate exclusive and it's a Dean Ambrose belt buckle. The lunatic fringe himself. Imagine wearing that. Oh my god, I don't wear belts, but I think I might have to get a belt for that because that is really, really cool. As you can see, it's this logo on the, on the belt buckle and it's a nice bronze one as well. Uh, so yeah, it says Duke Crate exclusive at the back and then it has the buckle and then the, the whole thing where you put it in. Oh wow, I am really chuffed with that. I have no clue what this is. Um, <laughs> let's have a look. It says fan it, clap it, wave it. So I don't know what is in it, <laughs> but we shall see. Oh sweet, it's Dean Ambrose. Nice. I love the fact we've got two Dean Ambrose items. So we have him there, hope you can see. And then uh, we have him on the back so you can wave it like that you could use it as a banner at the um, at a live show you can fan it so yeah i suppose that works and then clap it let's go ambrose let's go ambrose <laughs> i am a child when it comes to chance at wwe i'm the one who's always saying let's go roman while my boyfriend goes roman sucks and it's just like how dare you! Yeah, if you want to go to a wrestling show and you just want to use that instead of making a sign, or make a sign if you want to, but I'm, I'm just saying that's a good example if you didn't want to make one and just use that instead, just go like that. And it's not too big either, so then you're not blocking the person behind you who's watching the show as well. Right, coming up to the last item before the book. So we have a NXT iron-on patch. So if you collect patches and you want to put them, like iron them on onto your jacket or to your bag, and you're an NXT fan, perfect thing for you i rarely wear patches anymore so this is probably one of those things i'm probably gonna sew to a bag or something like that hopefully slam crate will bring in some more like they do with the pins and you know i'll be able to add more onto the bag just you know because show my love for wrestling so pretty nice right last is the book so the theme this month as i said before through the badge is the first so it says here, do you remember the first time you watched a WWE match? Yes, I do. The feeling of awe and excitement from witnessing historic first and amazing matches never truly goes away. That's what we're celebrating in our first WWE Slam Crate. Awesome, funny and inspiring firsts. So we can see what's inside the loot this month. So we had the Enzo and Cash shirt. We had the Dean Ambrose clapper. We had the New Day figurine. We had the Austin Aries uh card and i'm guessing that was in every card i did i thought it was going to be um randomized so it looks like everyone got the same one which is good we have the belt buckle we have the iron on patch we have the glasses for sasha banks and we have the pin so i'm going to read about the pin the very first time the official wwe championship title has been featured in an enamel pin form as one of the founding subscribers to wwe slam crate you've earned it Awesome! I'm really happy about that. Uh, let me see. Oh, the card, apparently, if it's autographed, you are one of the hundred recipients... Uh, you are one of the hundred recipients of the signed version, but I don't have the signed version, sadly. But, you know, you win some, you lose some. And on the inside, we have an interview with Xavier Woods. And if, if you don't know, he has a YouTube channel called Up, Up, Down, Down fantastic he plays with other wrestlers they talk about their their past before their favorite games and he also does loads of like tournaments and loads of retro games it's a fantastic channel i would recommend it and he is amazing he is literally like the king of the geeks he was in leeds last weekend playing a street fighter tournament in just like um I don't know, he just, <laughs> he just stumbled upon it somewhere and he was just like, I want to take part, and I just thought, that was amazing. Um, so let's have a look see what's on the inside. Oh, sweet, we have uh, uh, Shinsuke Nakamura when he won the NXT Championship for the first time. And that was an amazing match as well. I think that was TakeOver 
um, I think it was the night before Wrestlemania I believe I, or the night before SummerSlam or the other but that was a fantastic match and also the intro was brilliant so and I realised I said amazing too many times this this <laughs> this video and the box it has the first and it has <coughs> excuse me all three members of the New Day I'm guessing if you turn this round we can turn it into a wrestling ring but I don't really do that so I'll just show you the stand crate so that's the ring and that, the, the canvas and then there's the audience members so what do I think of this box because this is the first time I have seen it and I have not looked at any reviews my boyfriend saw it and he said I'd be really happy with it and I am so I'm going to be continuing this for as long as I can because I have, haven't got a wrestling uh, loot crates as yet or a unboxing because there is a UK one but I, I haven't subscribed to it as yet but I might do in future I think it's wrestle crates for UK um, maybe stop Akibento and swap one for the other because this is bi-monthly so it's only going to happen every two months so the next video for this will be January sometime probably about mid-January if it's okay if my post office sorts itself out because I can't get any of my mail at the moment it's really annoying so that is it for the slam crate this month I hope you enjoyed it if you have anything that you want me to open or anything I should be getting the Nintendo NES the mini version probably in the next couple of days so I might do an unboxing of that and do a preview of what it looks like on the TV but for now I shall see you all later bye loot great rocks loot great rocks loot great rocks loot great rocks